Pyramid Butte is a desert peak near Moab, Utah. The butte has little rock climbing value, but a class 4 hike leads to a seldom visited summit, offering excellent views and a great desert experience. It's a great day trip from Moab once you've ticked off the main attractions. The peak is 25 miles southwest of Moab in the Schaefer Basin. Drive on Potash Road along the Colorado River. The final few miles are on a terribly slow, bumpy road, but you'll get to stop and stretch your legs at the strikingly beautiful evaporation ponds along the way. The summit looks like a pyramid, I guess, or maybe more so from further away. It's taken us about an hour to drive here from Moab. Well, we've just pulled off the dirt road there. I'm just going to travel cross country, see a few weaknesses there. You can park your car to the west of the peak on a dirt road, then head cross country, avoiding the cryptobiotic soil, aiming for a large gully. The class 4 climbing is down low, climbing up a gully through the Cedar Mesa sandstone. Well, I have to do a little bit of zigzagging up some ledges here in this gully. There's a, an easy mantle move up there and probably a rock that somebody... Oh, knees, Melissa. And there's only one more move, I think, in this little bowl. It's got a bit of a high step there, friction. The ascent route zigzags to find weaknesses in the Cedar Mesa cliffs via gullies. One more little rock step there to get up, a little traverse. And we're going to head across to the next gully that way. There are cairns to follow, but as is often the case, the cairns don't always follow the best line because the cairn builder might have been going somewhere else or was lost. Then we can go up that bowl or gully and find a way somehow through that next little cliff band. Now there are a couple of easy little climbs up the mud rock there to get out of this gully. One to the right might be a bit easier. There is a large bench above the Cedar Mesa sandstone. Doing lots of zigzags, but definitely easier terrain there to the right hand side of the peak. There's a diagonal line up through there. Lots of zigzags for this route. Spending time in the desert, climbing and canyoning, I can't help but gain a novice interest in geology, which does actually help and add value for route choice decisions and navigation. The summit pyramid shape is caused by the poor rock quality disintegrating in the mountain falling down. The lower section of the pyramid is organ rock formation, which includes some short cliffs. The top of the pyramid is Moan Copy formation. Might be able to see the car there. And somewhere here. The summit is 5,200 feet above sea level, with about 900 feet of relief above the Schaefer limestone bench beneath. The top of the summit boulder is the best place for lunch. Excellent views surrounded by the Colorado River on three sides, towering cliffs all around, and the evaporation ponds to the north. The evaporation ponds are for a nearby mine where potash is mined and dissolved. The blue colour is copper sulphate which speeds up the evaporation process that leaves the potash behind which is then used as fertiliser. Pyramid Butte is a bit of a drive but the solitude, the desert hiking and the great summit views make this an experience worth doing.